of uh, the PO sheet project so this will be initially the PO sheet will be looking like this where we have the list of PO numbers and as we can see the processed column is blank right now we can we may go uh, from top to bottom which on the family, okay and click on the PO button now what happens is this one now turns red color and process becomes Y that means sheet is created for this with that same number because we can see a 017 we can sheet is 017 and the PO number automatically comes here to this okay now we start and number of invoices for example I so now it adds the this and it also adds the number of invoices so uh, we have to go slow here again let's say four side and it is going to add the four line items okay formatting we'll do later delivery date retention and other things you can fill and uh, the name is not appearing for some reason so you have to enter the salesperson name here uh, later on come from the email directly so once that is done we can go here and we can see like which one is already processed right we can select another different one and we can again 269 and uh, the 269 will also get created with that and uh, again we can do the same thing so this is completed uh,